Central Texas business is blowing up in a good way. Perhaps you have seen some of these big balloon sculptures at special events around the area. Well, stay tuned because we got something to show you. If you went to the Bell County Comic Con, you know exactly what we're talking about. Over the weekend, maybe you saw those balloons. But Chris Davis caught up with the artist as he was preparing last week. And Chris says that this is um, a special story because the creator's life wasn't always so inflated. Yeah, that's right, Sally. Uh, it started with just balloons like this one. I'm going to be making a dog here because this is the only thing that I know how to do. And I did know this before uh, I talked to this balloon artist, by the way. He did not teach me how to do this. I just want to make that clear. But Stuart Maui's business is called Blow Up Success. And he now gives motivational talks to high schoolers about using their talents for something more. But again, it all started with him doing this, just twisting up balloons. I'm having a little struggle here, twisting up balloons at kids' birthday parties. Everyone has a task here. Stuart Maui has thousands. Yeah, it's going to be sweet, man. Blowing it up. That is cool. It takes him days to finish. There's so many balloons that go into this. R2-D2, he was one of my favorite. You know, you wouldn't think that you could get such a precise pattern down with balloons. It's taken years for Maui to get here. So I started when I was 12. It was the first job I ever had. But back in the day, I was a professional clown. And that makes it impossible to find a girlfriend. After bouncing around the country doing this and that. I had just finished traveling the country selling flying squirrels. It's a long story. I was selling flying squirrels for a living. Maui landed in Austin, where he wasn't making a living. I would live in a hammock. So there was a scuba diving park on Lake Travis. It was really pretty. And uh, I would just go set up my hammock, I'd take a shower in the gym. He delivered pizzas and balloon roses with them for way better tips. Rose in a glass jar. It spawned an idea and blew up. Go big or go home. See, if I could do this, I would make one of these just to put in my house. He's climbed his way to huge installations at conventions and businesses. Just trying to turn myself into a balloon celebrity. His installations fetch thousands of dollars, 12 years removed from clowning, there's nothing funny about that. You know, and it all goes back to the balloons. Da -da -da. All right. Yeah, just a little bit more. I wanted okay. to finish so you guys didn't think I just ran off screen and, and got another one here. Yeah. So a little bit more twisting here. Maui, by the way, is 24 right now. Guys, he's been doing those big installations for the last four years, and he still makes balloon art for kids if they just come up to him, you should see some of the things that he Amazing. does. But now he's really focusing on those bigger projects. You're not bad. Look at that. That's, Look at that. That's pretty good, right? That's nice. That's that like is a dog. awesome. I mean, compared to his bashes. Ninja Turtle creations that he does yeah, and you know, all those other ones, but that's I'm, really I'm good. Getting, I'm getting there. It's it's a start, you right? Need a that's, that's how he started. A little Sharpie for this one. Where is it? I'm sorry. I'll put it back <laughs> so you can see it. So you need a Sharpie for the eyes. That's but, right. Um, what a cool story that he goes mm -hmm. and he talks to teenagers about. Listen, you know, if if something isn't your career path, keep trying and maybe your sure, talents exactly. will get you somewhere else. Focus on what you're good at and, and figure out how you can turn that into something that uh, you can do the rest of your life. And after Love hearing it. his life story, I feel exceedingly boring <laughs> compared to him. He's 24. Yeah. It's amazing. He's 24. Jeez. All right, Incredible. I'll give this back to you, right. I guess. We'll have to name it, though. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> maybe, maybe we can do a Facebook competition and see if you Let's can name it. Let's do that. Yeah. That's a good idea. All right, All right Chris, thank you. Thanks.